talk to, 70% of reproductive age women have fibroids. They are that common. Most fibroids are not actually impacting your fertility because they are remote from that implantation area, but that doesn't mean that they may not be impacting your life. From a fertility standpoint, we do take out fibroids that are submucosal, so inside the uterus or intramural, but pushing into that submucosal area. But fibroids of any place can cause you to be so anemic that you need blood transfusions, bleed through your clothes, and they may need to be addressed. There are some medications that can sometimes make the bleeding less. So this is where sometimes either birth control pills or medications like progesterone, there's some medications to help with potentially the bleeding, like something called transexamic acid. But surgery is a more definitive option, and surgical removal can really vary with fibroids. It can be a simple procedure, that same hysteroscopy, camera inside the uterus, which would be no incisions above, but it also could be a much bigger major surgery where you're going abdominally, either laparoscopically, which is with a camera, robotically with the robot, or even an open incision like a C-section.